Hello. Hello. Hi. Hey, how are Hi. you? I'll come take a look at the unit. Oh, okay. Bye, You gotta get up there. Right? Yeah. Um, so on an inspection, it says the heater is making a noise and the air is blowing. I guess. So uh, let's turn the heater on. What? I don't understand what kind of noise. Can y'all hear the noise downstairs? Or I hear it anything, man. The guy that yeah. inspected. I don't know. Mm -hmm. So. Okay. Let me turn it on for a while, then I'm gonna go up. Yeah. It's not too long. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> right. Yeah, that's why I want to try to come early as yeah. I could. Good thing, because I was about to head out. Yeah. I'll wait for you. Oh, oh um, you need to leave now? Well, I was gonna go do some. Yeah, give me give me uh, ten minutes. It's gonna take long. I yeah, mean, I, I want inspection. So. Then I probably uh, do you need me to write you something that's showing yeah. that we checked it up? Okay. And I just emailed it to you because I'm Perfect. Time. Okay. These buyers are really really picky. Yeah, man, I've been through it myself. Yeah. Yeah. I said he's gonna make a loud noise when the heater on. And they said the uh, emergency drain pan was full of water. Which is not now. I came by and did a maintenance on the unit. But, uh, we must be talking about that vibration. So I let the home on another. Cause they selling the house Tuesday. So like I say, he uh told me to do a maintenance on it. They ain't say he needed it. It was written up 
on the inspection. That is making loud noise and the pan is leaking up. But he didn't show me in it. An inspection. I told me he was selling. Well, doing an inspection, so I didn't do a uh, heater maintenance on it. I only did a uh, air conditioning maintenance. All right, let me go speak with him. Let's see if we can get this done tomorrow. All right. All right. What well, I was saying with that, that job there, uh, about a couple weeks ago, they sat in the house. <clears throat> they called me and said they wanted me to just do a maintenance on the unit. Um, they didn't tell me. So anyway, the buyer of the house contacted me and, and told me that uh, doing the inspection, it was like on page 24 and 25 that the, the heater was making a loud noise and uh, the emergency drain pan was full of water. So, like I say, I didn't know that, but I got the uh, the actual. So the buyer sent me the, the whole inspection report from everything from electricity, all the work that they had to get done. Um, but the homeowner should have gave me that. The seller should have gave me that when I was doing the inspection. Because pretty much I was just under the impression that I was just doing a uh, routine maintenance cooling. So I washed all the coils, you know, checked out the cooling, checked the refrigerant pressures, and all that good stuff. Uh, I, I don't do I don't I don't I don't do a maintenance for heating in the, in the summertime. But uh, <clears throat> they pretty much then you know made me clear what all I should have been checking because I would have checked the heater if he told me that was on the inspection report. We could have took care of that uh, when I was here the first time. Like I said, the drain pan, I mean, I flushed all the drain lines stuff out last time. So that, that that's the reason why it wasn't no water, nothing in the pan, emergency drain pan. But uh, it's Sunday, so I told them I'd come back and change that contact before and tomorrow. Um, so you're gonna have to give me give me a additional service fee uh, charge and and the cost I charge to uh, place the contact uh, even his wife even said it that she told him to give me the inspection report the first time I was out here and uh, she said he, he kind of told her that uh, I, I wouldn't know what to check but like I say, he just told me to do a maintenance on the unit. So, so I'm still gonna charge him for that. Uh, you know, going back out and taking a look at it. All right, they spec people. I'm out. Yeah, real quick. You see the contact? I have that contact in my truck, but uh, the guy need to leave. I would have went on and changed it out then. Started having to make another trip uh, back out there, but uh, like I said, I'm making. I'm, like I said, I'm charging another service fee anyway. So, but I'm making another trip tomorrow. But, but I did want to come out because I just ran another call. You don't work too much on Sundays, but I just ran a no cooling call, and uh, since this was on my way back. I just stopped by there and hurry up and troubleshoot it. So at least I I know what I'm uh, know what I need tomorrow. Uh, so yeah, that's that though. Everybody enjoy the rest of their weekend.